What started as an early morning rumor that South African music icon Yvonne Chaka Chaka had been blocked by security agencies from moving out the part of Africa Hotel to do a sound check at Lugiri Mango has been confirmed by police this evening. According to police, Chaka Chaka had entered the country on a visa visa, yet she had come to perform and required a work visa. So the foreign musician had initially been granted an ordinary visa as a visitor to Uganda, which was cancelled by immigration officials after it was realized that she had come as a performing artist in one of the New Year's events. Uh, as a result, she was advised together with her promoters to get the right working visa that could uh, have enabled her perform in any musical performance and avoid the pretense of an ordinary visit. Police also confirms that Chaka Chaka was later escorted to Entebbe Airport and put on a plane back to South Africa. The security task team that was working closely with the immigration officials this afternoon escorted Miss Mohinga and Tobizodwa Yvonne, popularly, popularly known as Chaka Chaka, to Entebbe International Airport where she boarded her next flight. Uh, to South Africa via Chigali. However, the singer says the decision not to perform at Nkuka was hers alone and she was known deported. Set the record straight as you can see, I am here, all is well. Desire, as they call you, I just want to say I love you. Thank you very much. I took a decision not to appear this evening at Nkuka because there were just too many things that I could not understand or explain. If somebody had explained to me, I really would have understood. But not deported, not arrested, not captured. Everything is fine. Everything is in order. I know my country is worried. My people are worried. My husband's worried. Everybody is worried. But I am fine. I am fine. Look, this is me. Where's everybody? Yvonne Chaka Chaka last performed in Uganda last year in August on a child concert aimed at raising funds to build a school for former street kids. While in Uganda, Chaka Chaka referred to people poor leader Robert Chagulin A.K. Bobby Wayne as Uganda's Nelson Mandela. And this is suspected to be the reason behind her deportation. These are the people and the children of Uganda. All they want is hope. They want hope for tomorrow. And uh, you've got my support. My support, you have. The organizer of the concert where she performed, Jacqueline Wolfson, was later also deported to the U.S. <laughs> The singer has been part of the African music scene for over 30 years, with songs like I'm Burning Up, Thank You Mr. DJ, Mukomboti, among others. Ivan Chimuchigozi, NTV.